And the rise has even more towns and cities taking safety precautions. We're talking now about, of course, mask mandates. Yeah, here to tell us a lot more about all of this, Fox News with Julia LeBlanc. She is live outside City Hall in Middletown. Good morning, Tim and Erica. Yeah, we're right outside of City Hall in Middletown because this is one of the places that decided just yesterday to start implementing its own mask mandates. They put this sign up once again uh, during the pandemic just yesterday asking people that they need to wear their masks if they're going to be heading into City Hall anytime soon. But then just hours after putting that sign up, they had to put this sign up saying that there's a COVID outbreak in their facility and now you can't get into City Hall at all, whether you're wearing a mask or not. Now we're told that there is an outbreak among city employees in Middletown and that it's contained to just those employees right now. However, they are trying to contain that outbreak and make sure that no one else gets COVID. We're told right now there is no risk to the public. And again, they're trying to avoid any further spread of the virus. We're told essential business will continue inside of City Hall, but it's all going to be online for now. Now, this is something other cities are trying to avoid right now. Outbreaks like this one also putting their own mask mandates in place, even though Governor Ned Lamont has made it clear he won't be doing the same on the state level. Towns and cities like East Hartford, New London, Mansfield, Newington and Norwich are asking people to wear masks while in government buildings regardless of their vaccination status. I just know that hospitalizations in New England at South Eastern Connecticut, where we are, uh, have been on an upswing. The positivity rate has been going up. Um, we just very concerned. Now, some other big news we want to tell you about the state capitol building. A letter was sent from the Joint Committee on Legislative Management yesterday, changing their policies there too. Now, starting today, everyone who enters the Capitol building needs to be wearing a mask. Again, regardless of their vaccination status, the letter citing that the decision was based on increasing COVID positivity rates across our state. Now, back out here live in Middletown, we just saw a couple of people trying to get into City Hall. Again, the building is closed until at least Monday because there is a COVID outbreak, we're told, among city employees. It's a small outbreak right now, but they want to keep it that way and make sure that nobody is at risk at this time. If you need to make any payments. We're told you can do so online. They also have a drop box at the front of the building if you need to do it that way too. We're live right outside of Middletown City Hall. Julia LeBlanc, Fox 61 News.